So I had an opportunity to go to Costco and check out a few things and just wanted to let you all see what I found. So check it out. About to go in this Costco and see what I can find or not find. I know now is the time that if you're shopping for winter clothes, now is the time to do it. Actually, a month ago is the time to do it. Um, also, let's see what they have for maybe prepping up in here. See if they have anything new or different. And you can see right behind me, the clouds, it's about to rain, so. But nevertheless, we're going in here. Let's go. The first thing I noticed is one of these here. It's gourmet. It's an oven that has plenty of uses. One forty nine ninety nine, not bad actually. But what I love about it is the fact that you can use it to dehydrate. Everyone should be looking to dehydrate something, uh, especially what we got going on with our food sources now. Then this food saver here. Everyone should have one of these. If not, I would advise getting one. Keep your food safe and fresh, sealed. Uh, $99.99 for this vacuum sealing system here. Everyone should have one of these. Because things are going on right now that we need to self-sustain. And, and look at this. I didn't even know Costco had these. Ready-wise emergency food supply. And they're dwindling down. From what I've been told, they had more here. $59.99. And the good part about it is once you're done with the food in there, you can actually reuse those buckets. Where I'm from, we reuse things, certain things, especially buckets. So it has all the nutritional, nutrition facts on the back here. Of course, I got plenty of water here. Got to have water. You know, in emergency events, that's one of the first things to go is water. But looking right here, I wonder how I could use this. How could we use this, people? I don't like the price, fourteen ninety nine ninety nine. I know I've seen these uh, for less other places, but if someone like it, I mean, doesn't have to doesn't have to be this one in particular, but little storage sheds come in handy. I've seen people use these for actual to actually actually store, you know, their food supplies in generators. Many different things. Uh, this one's not too bad. I have seen some better. Uh, more well built, I guess you can say. Now, people seem to sleep on nuts and cashews and peanuts and trail mix. They have a pretty good life, uh, shelf life. I know they last at least for a good year. Best Buy. At least for a year as you can see on on some of these here so don't underestimate or don't sleep on having this put little small bags of these or in your, in your bug out bag or if you want a shelter in place make sure you have some nuts pistachios a lot of people love pistachios to be completely honest with you, I've never eaten a pistachio. But in a crunch situation, yeah, I would definitely uh have some. <laughs> now, as far as winter clothes, now is the time to buy them. I see these long sleeve shirts here. If you don't have winter clothes right now, please most definitely get them right now. Because you know what? You never know what people have planned ahead for us. So get them right now while you can before it gets cold. I was once told 
if you're shopping for winter clothes in the cold, you started shopping for them too late. And the prices aren't too bad here for these these fleece jackets. Batteries can never have enough batteries. Double A, twenty ninety nine, not bad for a big pack of Duracell. Not bad at all. I think I'll grab one of those. Uh, also, you can see in the shopping cart there, I also grab the flashlights. AAA, most things in my house that have batteries take AAA. So I definitely got some of those. And generators. I remember back in the day, a generator was kind of a luxury. Now it is a necessity, an absolute, complete necessity. Power outages. Emergency catastrophes. You have to have them. And Costco is a place to get some. Power uh, inverter here. Furman inverter. So these are some things here that if you don't have them right now, you definitely want to save up and, and, and get some. Unless you know someone that's close to you that you're real cool with, maybe a family member or a friend that has one that will allow you to share it with them or i know some people that have uh you know two or three uh, generators maybe they'll let you have one or buy one from them so i hope you all enjoyed always remember get what you can while you can god is a provider and get ready stay ready god bless yeah.